Welcome to the boss. Now, before we start this video, it's extremely important that we do take note of the early access disclaimer that's currently on this game. Um, the boss came out in March 2021 and it's still currently an early access title. So it's now December 2022. I'm going to return to the boss due to it's had an update just recently, this month in December 2022, the boss has had an update called Phase 2 Released. So, early access version, the boss is here, Phase 2 has officially started. So, the updates on this are, 1. Upgraded to Unreal Engine 5, new anti liaising technique that brings better quality with reduced resolution scaling, a new physics engine, moved root editing into the sub menu, disabled the old options menu, switched sound engine, added more sound options, updated multi display, various fixes for root editing, various fixes for options menu, passengers may greet and ask for a ticket, Atron and cockpit buttons can now be used with a controller. Not sure if I pronounced that right. Added buzz selection menu. Updated routing display. Added a repaint. Updated traffic, AI behavior at various places. Fixed telemetry crash when returning to main menu. Fixed startup crash, art and level fixes performance optimizations and again they also make you aware it says please be aware that the impact of performance optimizations varies from system to system due to hardware configurations installed software and other programs running in the background so yeah obviously obviously it does yeah so I'm going to take a look at these updates today we're going to play it and we do get a new boss three I believe it's a uh, E-City Buzz or something like that. We're going to be driving that today. So uh, let's take a look at these updates. Oh, it's also very important to also mention that you've only now got a couple of days to buy this before there's a price increase. Along with these updates, a few days they're giving... Oh, my steering wheel's come disconnected. I hope my steering wheel's going to work here. I've just had to... Dis, um, Connect steering wheel. I'm playing on the G27 shifter pedals. Um, it's just become disconnected. Anyway, what was I saying? It's very important if you haven't already purchased this game, um, you've only got a few days left before the price increase comes in. They are going to increase the price on this game. Um, I'm just going to dive straight into it here. Um, I have roughly um, just set up a brief configuration on this new bus, uh, but I am going to have to try and remember all the controls and things, because this game I don't actually play a great deal, um, and there is a reason for that, uh, of which I will tell you. Um, how do we start this? we will figure out, there we go. Um, I think we've now got to set that computer finger majiggy up here. I don't know a great deal about this game because I don't play it a lot. Anyway, while I'm setting this up, let me just tell you my system settings. Or should I say my PC specs? Right, my CPU, i7-7700K, and it's clocked at 420 gigahertz. I mean, is that a bit of a fossil nowadays? You know, my, my, my computer's turning into a bit of potato um, nowadays compared to the hardware Hello. that's uh, coming Good out. Good we have up. got, I have got installed 32 um, gigabytes of RAM on that. And the graphics card is a GTX 1080 Ti edition. And uh, the game itself is installed on an SSD. So my computer may be becoming a little bit of a dinosaur these days. With the cost of living, etc, etc, I can't really justify spending... Uh, you know, I'm going to be spending a couple of thousand pounds easily to upgrade my machine. Uh, possibly if I was to replace all the uh, components. But Thimble Simulator runs great. Great game. Love it. Brilliant. 10 out of 10. Highly recommended Firm Bus Simulator. Um, Tourist Bus Simulator. Love it. Wish they had expanded on it. Runs okay. 
Love the game. Great game. Oh, yeah. Two absolutely Thank fantastic you. titles come out of TML Studio. Is it TML Studios or TLM? Anyway, two absolutely fantastic games. Highly recommended. I believe they're now available for consoles. Um, go check them out if you haven't done so already. Then the buzz. The buzz is here. Now, I actually received this free of charge. Thank you very much, we have to say. Back in uh, 2021, I think it was, when this was released, um, the game key was, I received it free, free of charge. I, I play a lot of driving games. Um, but the problem I have is performance on my old potato machine here. And other games run absolutely fantastic. The new Call of Duty game that comes out, not a problem whatsoever. You know, um, you know, lots of games run absolutely brilliant. But this one, bear in mind, this is still early access and there is warnings, but they say better optimizations. And this is what I'm interested in. Um, just trying to figure out here, what have we got to do next? So if we can turn this on. I'll leave that off because it's. Uh, might uh, cause me performance issues. Let's just change the temperature, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, why I'm setting this uh, buzz up, because I don't really know what I'm doing. I've only had one go of it. Uh, performance issues are still a problem for me on this game. I'm, I'm beginning to think now that my computer will just not run this. And it doesn't matter whether I have this game settings all set on low or all set on epic. It's exactly the same. Messing about with the settings does nothing for me, so that's quite interesting. If I have them all set on low, no difference. If I have them all set on epic, there isn't a great deal of difference whatsoever. And it's the same with the traffic. If I put the traffic on 100% or I put the traffic on 0%, same with the pedestrians, there isn't a great deal. There's hardly any noticeable difference for me in performance. The whole game still runs a little bit like thick soup very very slowly um, but saying that I love the game I like this game um, so we spoke about the updates we've spoken about the new buzz what we're in now um, optimization for me isn't great what you're going to see is what you're going to see you'll, you'll see a few splutters splutters I hope we don't see any splutters stutters um, you may see it stutter a few times, but um, I just wish they would work better on the optimization so I could enjoy this absolutely fantastic game because it is, really is a good bus game. So we're going to drive along this line now as fast as I can. Um, if you don't, if you've never seen this game, you will get some idea just how big the routes are. This is just a section of the route that we're going to play through today oh no i'm not uh i was thinking it was very narrow here we've knocked a post down i need a mirror pressing tab brings the mirrors up you can put various mirrors and things up there we go right hand side mirror might be able to drive properly now so uh, yeah that's my little bit of a grumble over i hope tml studio is it tml or tlm tlm i don't know um i'm not done my revision i can't remember i do like the studio and I do like the games Hello. that they produce Can you put and, a ticket uh, I really want a good PC to run this but uh, unfortunately my PC struggles with it optimization needs better optimization so if you've got a PC with perhaps lower specs than mine you're perhaps um, suffering the same sort of performance issues that I'm suffering on this. There you go, my lady. Get on board. Is that it? Everybody on? Right, let's go. So the game itself, mostly, overwhelmingly, positive reviews on the Steam forum. So a lot of people liking the game, and I can't understand that. The actual game and the gameplay itself is very good. The driving is uh, very good in the towns as well. Like it. I decided to hit the game up again once I'd seen the update had come out. I was very keen to see how the optimization was. Um, because because it's a major problem for me, and it sort of spoils the game. But in mind, it is still early access, and there is a disclaimer, so hopefully it's going to get better. But 
if you're wondering why I haven't done many videos on this, the reason, you know, the reason is, um, I basically struggle to run it on my PC. My PC is not good enough for games like this anymore. Right, there we go. That took a little bit of sorting out. Oh, it wants to change. There we go. Morgen. So, Ein Fahrschein, dear. bitte. Have you got the correct change, madam? She doesn't speak English. <laughs> this is all great, isn't it? How you take the cash and everything on this little machine here, how it's all done. It's absolutely fantastic. I mean, um, it's very good. Sometimes they do ask for the re a uh, receipt, particularly when you... Uh, I hope they don't on this one because I can't remember how you do it. Sometimes they do ask for a receipt, a, uh, receipt when they pay by card and uh, you have to print off a receipt. And uh, it took me a while to figure out how to do that and I hope they don't ask for one as I'm driving along here now recording this because uh, I, won't be, <laughs> I won't remember how to do it. So regarding the uh, the update to Unreal Engine 5 on this game and optimization, it hasn't done anything for me. It's it's exactly it's exactly the same. I mean, it's not running. Don't get me wrong. It's not running too bad, but it's not running as good as um, Firm Bus Simulator or Tourist Bus Simulator. Hello. Ticket. He wants a ticket. Give him a ticket. Single ticket, Berlin AB, amount one, three euros, payment method card. There you go, sir. You see, what the problem is, as a gamer, I'm rather fussy, and as I get older, I get miserable, and I become even more fussy. I want, I see, I like video, I like video games that run nice and smoothly, so I can enjoy them better. This is still an early access, let's not forget that this is early access gameplay, and this game might be running a lot smoother than some of you. Who have played this and I've got lower PC specs than uh, what I have. Uh, but I've tried everything, get this game to run as nice as uh, Thimble Simulator, but uh, I can't do it. That's why I don't play it very often, and I really do want to play it, but it annoys me all the lags and spikes that come into it. Anyone want a ticket? Anyone want pay by card? Shut the door, let's go. I might do a few more Let's Plays, I don't know. Smack the like button if you want to see more Let's Plays of this game. And I'll put, uh, I might put some no commentary Let's Plays up of the game, because people get a bit fed up of me talking. I think for me, Firm Buzz Simulator is number one, Tourist Bus Simulator number two, and this will be, this one will be at the bottom, currently, unless they improve it, or I get a better PC, it's probably me and my PC, I mean let's, let's not just put the blame on the game, 
you, you know it can be your hardware and uh, I can't justify I can't I cannot justify spending thousands of pounds to play this game really at the moment although perhaps I might be able to put uh, one of them 30 a 3070 graphics card I might just be able to put that one of them in my machine and I just wonder how much better this game would actually run I don't know how much are one of them nowadays let me know in the comment section below how much are they about 600 pounds a lot of money isn't it that's my heating bill Driving around the city is very good. <laughs> I was uh, messing about with the contra con contrast, is it? And the bloom and the lens flare, really. Yeah? Um, just trying to adjust them a little bit and I don't know what the default settings are now I want them to go back to the default settings but there isn't a button that you can press that will revert them back to the default settings and I've forgotten what they were so if anybody knows what the default settings are for the uh, for the bloom the contract contrast lens flare uh, etc let me know in the comment section below because uh, I really I, I would like to know what the uh, standard default settings are but yeah it's very good very good buzz game excellent buzz game very good I can see why positive reviews there's a few negative ones let's say but they're, they're all grumbling about the performance side of it um, like me I wish I could get this game run better I've tried everything low settings everything switched off in the background no difference really between low settings and epic settings I did have a look at my task manager and I did see it was absolutely hammering my uh, graphics card it was just really heavy on it and the CPU it just wasn't using at all maybe that's the problem I, I'm no expert I'm just a gamer I just play games Open the doors. Hope he doesn't want a ticket. Good. Morgen, ich benötige ein Ticket. Bye. 
Hauptbahnhof Museumsinsel. I don't actually know what this vehicle drives like in real life, but uh, the acceleration on it, it, it moves, this does. I've left some of these AI cars standing at the lights to put the boy racers to shame. Don't actually know how... Uh, how long this route is because I don't know if I've done this one before because I don't play this game very often. I'm actually I'm actually surprised it's taken them so long uh, to uh, to get better optimization options which I can't actually notice in the game, to be honest. It still seems to run how it was uh, when it was first released for me. May not look too bad on the playback, but it, it sort of runs like sticky glue. Jüdenstrasse. It wants to go, but then it stops, and then it wants to go, and then it stops. It's so like real life, this, uh, this, uh, this particular instance is here. We're sitting here hoping and praying that we're going to get through these traffic lights on this go. The game portrays that very good. Yes, we got through the lights. Where do we go here? I'm not used to these uh, road systems at all. Uh, I think down here. There's the bus stop. I think there's a few people there waiting as well this time here.
Littenstraße. und U-Bahnhof Alexanderplatz, Kroner Straße. Morgen. Shut the door on the uh, on the uh, on the old lady there. I do that quite often. Sometimes I'll shut the doors, and uh, all of a sudden a passenger will just turn up because I'm not uh, I'm not looking in the mirrors. I can't go. What's going on here? Just messing about with the various buttons. I've obviously got a door open. I've got the handbrake. The handbrake's on. I have tried switching it off. This this coach, I believe, has got two doors. I suspect the back door is open, and uh, I need to find the button to uh, find the button. There we go. I need to find the button that I opened it with. I think it's the last one on my uh, on my shifter of the uh, red buttons. The coach, the bus won't pull off if the doors are open, you see. Now we've got to try and filter in. Oh, lovely, we managed to filter in there. No uh, no arguing from the AI. The AI are behaving absolutely magnificent, I have to say. Um, they seem to be okay. I've had no problems with the AI as of yet. I played, you know, not that I've played hours and hours of the game at the moment, but... Uh, not really ran into any major problems with the uh, with the uh, AI yet. It accelerates really good. This uh, this E City bus does. I'm not sure if it's supposed to do if it's supposed to accelerate as quick as what it does. Maybe it's like this in real life. I don't know. Maybe somebody will give me a go of one. <laughs> Nobody wants a ticket. Nobody wants to play by card. How do I know? Oh, is that a little old lady wants to come on? Come on. How do I know she's paid? Right, off we go. Can't go. I've got a door open again. It's the back door that's open. And I don't know which button it is that closes it.
because the part brake stays on with one of the doors open. There we go. It's the back door, Luke. Not the back door. The other, the other door. I found the button. Yeah, there we go. That's why the coach, the bus won't pull off because the other doors open, and I don't know which button. I'm pressing any button, you see. I think it's the last one on my. Uh, on my uh, shifter. So I'm not too sure if we if we are approaching the last stop or maybe near the last stop. But uh, yeah, regarding the updates, I still can't fully enjoy this game to its full potential due to my PC. is uh, it's it's it, it's just not good enough, I don't think, to run the game in its current current uh, state I hope I hope further more optimizations do come updated um, with this game because it is a good game uh. so I'm going to keep an eye on this and I will come back and play more of this game and uh, keep an eye on the updates but I'm not, I, I will be honest, I'm not currently playing this a great deal, uh, because it doesn't, uh, it doesn't run that smoothly for me, no matter what settings I actually have it on. I think I'll stick with Fame Buzz Simulator. <laughs> Like I say, I might throw Mine. up. Uh, Mine. Someone's going to ask for a ticket here, aren't they? Mine. There we go. I knew. I knew it. Harshine. Sorry, madam. I'm looking at your chest there. <laughs> I'm trying to get the. Uh, trying to get onto the uh, ticket machine. Hi. 
benötige einen Fahrschein. go there's your ticket I'm not familiar with the ticket machine because uh, I've not played a great deal of the uh, I've not put many hours on the game at all can we get out in traffic we've got a lot of traffic here oh there we go one of the AI cars just stops and let us out if you want to see more of the buzz smack the like button I will play it a bit more probably put more um, no co some a few no commentary um, videos of of the bus. Most definitely going to keep an eye on the updates. Hopefully, more updates will come along. There's going to be more updates because the game's still in early access. So, I'm most definitely going to keep an eye on their newsletters and feeds um, to see what uh, updates come out for this. What updates come out for it in the future, should I say? Mine. Anybody want a ticket? Anybody playing by paying by card? No. Away we go. That was easy. Easy peasy, that was. It's a long route, isn't it? Some of the AI cars, I mean, the AI cars and everything, they all look fantastic. It's, it's, to be honest, it's very similar. It is the same as Fame Bus Simulator, isn't it, regarding graphics and the coaches and everything. But uh, for me, it just, it just doesn't run as well as Fame Bus Simulator. Warschauer Straße. Is this the end of the line? No buzzies. I think this may be the end of the route. Yeah, route complete. Uh, I think you can go on and uh, go on to the next route from here. Or go back to the main menu. We'll go back to the main menu. So, that's my first look. I've come back to the buzz. Um, not been playing it a great deal um, since it was released. Um, due to... I can't actually get it run very well on my PC. I thought, I'd make, I thought you know, after this major update that's come out, I was really excited, but sadly for me on my PC, it's still running just a little bit slow. Um, I'm going to keep an eye on the updates on this. Um, I might put up a few Let's Plays um, to follow. But um, if we go here, we can just have a look. What settings have I actually got this on? If I go into the... Uh, 
See why it says gamma, contrast, bloom. I messed all them up. I don't know what the standard options are. If anybody knows what the standard options are, please let me know in the comment section below. But uh, they're the quality settings that I currently played on just. And to be honest, if I put them all on low, it makes no difference to when I put them all on epic. There's very little difference there whatsoever. It's the same with the traffic. If I have the traffic 100% or on 0%, there's not much difference in performance for me. Um, I'm going to keep an eye on this game. I'm going to see what further updates come out for this because I do like this sort of game. I love Fern Bus Simulator. Very good. Tourist Bus Simulator. Excellent. The Buzz. It's still early access, isn't it? We all saw the disclaimer at the beginning. It's still early access. Hopefully, it's going to get better. So, I'm going to keep an eye on this. Um, so, yeah. That's it, folks. Have a nice day. Happy Christmas. Happy holidays. It's coming up to Christmas, isn't it? Maybe I'll do another video real soon. I'm sure I will. So uh, if you haven't done so already, smack that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Say hello in the comment section below. Taddy bye.